All right, we're gonna go to the main quest. So find out where the limping bandit lives. Let's go talk to some people, I guess. We need to. We'll go talk to the vendors first. Um, I think I need like a trader trader to buy. I don't think- God be with you. This guy's the baker. Lord yeah, this guy's the fucking baker. I gotta find someone who would have that. I'm looking for a fellow who lives here, but I don't know his name. Do you know anyone with a limp? What would you want with him? Well, it's- Whoa, wait, shit. I didn't mean God to do that. I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry. Ginger's, uh, wait, Ginger, uh, on a visit. Are you kidding me? The one guy I talked to was the main dude. By asking the locals, I found out the limping band I'm looking for is called Lubosh, and they even told me where he lives. How the fuck the one guy knew? Now I gotta go find Lubosh. Come on, man. Owned. Master Detective. Whoa! Yeah. Oh, he lives right here. Wait, there's a bunch of people outside his house. Why are there so many people outside his house? It's gotta be it. citizens move along there's nothing to see here that's what you call nothing to see i'd like to know what something to see looks like <laughs> okay Jesus, Saint peter this is all i need we'll have to send word to sir hanush that might not be necessary who are you i'm henry of scallets in the service of hanush's captain bernard i'm investigating the attack at neuhof and I think this could be related. Well, I'm the bailiff of Auschwitz. And I say we don't want any of that kind of trouble around here. What makes you think this has anything to do with Neuhof? One of the folk at the stud farm recognized someone from Auschwitz among the bandits. We have no bandits or murderers around here. Really? They say he had a limp? Oh, fuck. Shit. Well, allow me to introduce you. To Limpy Lubosh. Limpy Lubosh. What the hell? Oh my god. Oh, nothing's ever easy. I'll have to take a look around and ask a few more questions. That's all right with you. You can take this mess off my hands and welcome to it. As for what else there is to find out, I don't know. But look and ask all you like. Look and ask all you like. It's because you slept till 10. Yeah, I should have knocked. I should have lockpicked. Who was Limpy Lubos? A poor crofter and a scoundrel. Can't say I'm too surprised what happened to him. He kept company with all sorts of vermin. He was always getting into some kind of trouble. Punch-ups in the tavern and what have you. Ah, why did he limp? How come he limped? He got that from some villainy or brawl a long time ago. Has he been up to anything suspicious lately? Hmm. I don't know. The last few days he didn't go anywhere. He was home the whole time. But he always kept everyone in the village at arm's length. Hmm. Did he have any kith or kin in the village? None. A loner he was. I don't know the last time I saw him with anyone. 
Do you happen to know where he was on the night of the Neuhof raid? I've no idea. He kept his distance from other folk, so you never knew if he was away or holed up at home. Okay, this guy was useless. When did you find the body? I will say 5 a.m. Just now. And nobody saw or heard anything. I don't know how they could gut him like that without someone hearing him scream. Shit. Another thing about loot, boss. Oh, no, that's it. Okay. Well, you're fucking useless. You guys still standing here? Anybody know Lubish? Labosh? Christ, your clothes. Were you assaulted? Damn bandits, may they burn in hell. Yo, this is my usual drip. I'm fine. I've come in the name of Sahanish of Lyper. I'm investigating the massacre in Neuhof, and now a murder here as well. Can I ask you a few questions? Ask away. Who was this Lubosh who was murdered? He was a drunkard and a beast. And lazy too. Idle hands are the devil's tools. Idle hands are the devil's tools, chat. Have you noticed anything you gotta keep typing. Recently? The only thing seemed suspicious was how a rogue like him suddenly started going to church. Now I see why, of course. Going to church? Do you know what Lubosh was doing the day Neuhoff was raided? What do I care about that scoundrel? I was glad he stayed out of my way. Alright, we're all. good. We, I mean, our objective just updated. God bless. Yeah, if I go to the bathhouse, does it repair all my armor? Or do I have to go to, like, an armor smith or some shit? And then I need to go to a blacksmith to get everything going. Right, the bathhouse is where I go. Blacksmith and tailor. You can wash your clothes. Yeah, the bathhouse will wash my clothes. There's not a bathhouse here, though, unless it's one of these south. You can buy tailor kits. Actually, wait, don't I have a tailor kit? I looted one. Oh, no, this is an armor's kit. Oh, uh, I'm just, this item is too damaged to repair. You don't have enough skill to repair this item. All right. Wait, BA? Where am I going here? Find out more about Limpy Lubosh? Talk to the priest. Let's go talk about the talk to the priest first. this fucking priest. Oh. The blessings of our good lord be with you, father. I'm here in the name of Sahanish of Lyper, investigating the massacre at Neuhof, which seems to be connected to a murder here. Can I ask you a few questions? It seems Sir Hanush is employing children as investigators. But ask as you wish, boy. I hope this nasty business will be cleared up quickly. Did you know Lubosh? What was he like? bit of a lost soul. Simple, rough fellow, but at heart I don't think he was such a bad person. Did you notice anything? Did you notice anything suspicious recently? My child, all sorts of suspicious things have been going on recently. People like Lubosh don't know what to do about it, and sometimes they do stupid things. That's really not a lot of help to me, Father. I'm sorry to hear that. Okay. Do you know what Lubosh was doing on the day Neuhoff was raided? Unfortunately... I do know, and I'd like to help you with your investigation, but I can't. What? I'm bound by certain vows that forbid me to tell you. Vows more important than catching dangerous murderers? There are laws of God above the laws of man, son, and one of those is the sanctity of the confessional. What the hell is this? Father, surely you can't be serious. There must be situations in which you can make an exception. There are things that apply always, no matter what the circumstances, and this is one of them. Come on, man. There's no way I'm going to win against this guy. But Lubosh is dead. You can't hurt him, but if you don't tell me, more innocent people may die. 
If I told you well. I would be betraying a vow that's a cornerstone of the Holy Church, if people believed the sanctity of the confessional couldn't be trusted, the consequences would be even worse than that. Worse than the death of innocent Christians? Worse than the murderer escaping punishment? No one escapes punishment. Okay. Father, Lubos was my only lead to the Neuhof Raiders. Only he could tell me who was responsible for that massacre. If I don't find out who it was, it will probably happen again. Surely you wouldn't want that. I wouldn't. But I can't betray the sanctity of the confessional. I'll tell you what. Give me some time and I'll try to think up some way of helping you. Suppose we talk it over in the evening. In the tavern. Over a cup of good wine. Maybe we'll come up with something. All right. Thank you, Yo, Father. what the hell, man? Watch over you. John Hus, meet the parish priest in the tavern in the evening. What the hell, dude? This guy's just procrastinating. All right, he said in the evening. Let's just have time pass by. This is a main quest. This isn't a side quest. Isn't this a main quest? Yeah, this is a main quest. Wait, meet the parish priest in the tavern. Oh, wait, no. Yeah. Alright, hey, is this the tavern here? Is this not considered evening yet? The bell is ringing. It rings all day. Here we go. Now we're good. Go walk. I don't know where the fucking bathtub is, chat. Shut the fuck up. When I find the fucking bathhouse, I'll go take a goddamn bath. Jesus. The blessings of our Lord be. And with you, lad, take a seat. I could do with a bite to eat. Pope Clement the Seventh. I'm sorry I can't tell you everything. But maybe we can work something out. But first, I'd like to hear something about you, my son. With whom do I have the honor? Where are you from? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm from Scalitz. Oh, I'm sorry. What about your kin? They're dead. Well, I'm sorry to hear that. Here, we'll drink to them. It must have been terrible. What the hell? It was terrible. It seemed so pointless. We had no warning. They just appeared and began the slaughter. God knows why. They killed anyone who didn't make it to the shelter of the castle. My parents, my girl, even the Deutsch who was on Sigismund's side. I didn't make it to the castle. I wanted to try and help my parents, but there was nothing I could do. Then I fled to Talmberg with the Cumans on my heels. They almost killed me. They slaughtered people in the surrounding villages. There was a pile of bodies in front of the church in Rovna. Folk who tried to take refuge there, but they... My poor child. May God grant them eternal rest. And how did you come to get this assignment? I'd have expected Sir Hanish to send that old grouch, Bernard. He did send him. He did, but I found a witness and the trail led here to Ujit, so he sent me here to follow it up. Ah, well, congratulations. It's nice to see someone using their head to find things out instead of torture. We'll have to drink to that. Now the most important here, thing. Mate? What actually happened at Noyo? The good folks here about are saying all kinds of terrible things, but I take most of it with a pinch of salt. This time they weren't exaggerating. The rumors aren't exaggerated this time, unfortunately. The Neuhof stud farm was raided by bandits, but they didn't come to pillage or even take the horses. They only wanted to kill. They maimed the horses and slaughtered some people. I'm sure they would have killed more, but the bandits quarreled among themselves and broke off the attack. And judging by what's left of our Lubosch, they're still settling accounts. I see it's every bit as bad as people claimed. Dreadful. Well then, yeah. 
Here's to those poor souls who had to die so pointlessly and so terribly. I've told you all about me. Now it's your turn, Father. You don't look much like our parish priest at home. Let's get straight to the point. Well, we've had an agreeable chat, but now let's get down to business. So, about this confessional seal. Do you really want more innocent people to die? Henry, that's not how it works. There are matters in which you can't make exceptions because if you do it once, you'll forever be tempted to do it again. If people stop believing in the church because their confessional secrets are betrayed, they won't trust anyone, and that's worse than even the most hideous crime. Come on, man. I understand, but that means I've reached a dead end. Those cutthroats will strike again, and I can't stop them. Chin up, lad. I might have a solution. What? If I tell you what Lubos told me, I'd be betraying the confessional secret. But, first thing tomorrow, I'll try something I think might help you. Word of honor? On my soul. Hey, what I always the wondered hell? about the things a priest tells his congregation. Where is do you get the ideas for your sermons? Well, Ujits is in Prague. It's not enough to instruct people. They have to be entertained, too. If I only read from the Bible, I'd soon be preaching to an empty church. Our priest wasn't exactly a bard. So what do you preach to your flock about? It has to be something topical. Condemning vices. And, of course, describing them in detail. A tongue lashing about the two popes goes down well these days. And stories from real life, with a nice moral to them, are popular as well. Especially if they're about fornication and similar scandalous vices. Can you give me an example? Well, recently a priest by the name of Jan Hus started preaching in Prague, in the Czech language, and the people liked it. I hear he always has a full house. A journeyman who heard him told me what Hus is preaching, and I like the sound of it. I'm thinking about putting it in my own repertoire. What's so amazing about it? The preaching of Master Jan Hus about Mother Church. The lamentable well in which the church is drowning has turned to poison. And nearly the whole of Christendom is contaminated. They don't know mercy. Their hearts are corrupted by longing for wealth. And they shamelessly profit from everything. You want to baptize a child? Pay. You want to steal and murder? Pay and you will have absolution. What Yo. if the devil himself were to pay? Would he ascend to heaven too? With such money gained from the poor, they buy beautiful horses to ride and needless servants to pamper them. They gamble at dice and dress their whores in expensive fur. While Jesus Christ walked barefoot and had no place to lay his head. Damn, Look man. to your consciences, you robbers of the poor, for you are seen by God and his people too. Amen. Wow. Well, this Jan Hoos character is quite a rebel. Oh, the congregation will love it. I don't doubt it. Let's drink to that. This guy's Funny. ridiculous. That last bit reminds me of someone. What do you mean? My situation's completely different. Hoos preaches against the prelates and the clerics who are robbing the poor. Look at me. I don't have a pot to piss in. I'm no better off than the folk I preach to. I'm one with them in poverty and suffering and everything that troubles them. I yeah. drink with them and curse those stuffed habits in Sassau Monastery. Damn. All right. Where can I find out more about his teachings? You like it? I copied down some of his sermons. If you're interested, you can read them at my presbytery. All right, whatever. Thanks for the sermon, but I think I've been morally uplifted enough. Oh, it's getting quite late. What are your plans, Father? What do you suppose? We have a drink, of course. Yeah. Ah, that sounds like a good plan. I knew you wouldn't let me down. This guy's a very ridiculous priest.
Enough of this! Bailiff! Come on over here, sit down and have a drink with us. Don't vex me again, Father. It's three hours past dusk, and curfew is long gone. So what? So, I'll have you all whipped, and put in the stocks, and I'll write a letter to the bishop about you, priest. Well, nothing to worry about then. Everyone knows the only one around here who can write is me. <laughs> Enough! <laughs> Men! Throw them out. <laughs> you looking for a fight? Henry, back me up. Wait, for real? Oh my god, what the hell is going on right now? Are we Come actually? On, oh my god. Oh, Take that! God damn! Why are you telling me about a tournament in Rate, man? Ow! Fucker! Who the fuck is who? You got kill? Did I just fucking kill him? Oh my god, I killed him. Is that a guy? Oh, it's a barrel. Yo, he's dead. Yo, where's the priest? For God's sake, there. What? Over there. Help! Over there. What the fuck? Do something! My God! Over there. Oh my God! I have! So oh my no. God! There's a guy there. Yo, what the fuck just happened? I don't know if I can load back up. I don't think. I don't think. I don't think so. Oh my god. Did I just fucking load all the way back here? Shh. Who was limpy? How, he, how come he limpy? Another thing. How, how he got. When did you oh find the body? Oh my god. god. It won't be. It won't be. It god won't be that it. bad. It won't be that bad. I've come. Have you no. Dude, that's, that's fucking all. ridiculous, man. God bless. I don't even know what happened. I guess I didn't help him. I was attacking the wrong person. Yeah. Yeah. I picked the body up and they panicked. Yeah, it's not it's not that bad. We'll get there very fast. The blessings of our good did Do you know what? Did you mock them? Father. I'm just gonna do the same shit. Alright. In the evening. All right, we'll meet him and then do everything. Yeah, I'll save in the for the evening.
I don't think it's too late. The blessings. And the blessings of. And oh, God damn it, my stomach hurts. Okay. I'm sorry, I can't. I'm from uh, that him. Go uh, now. Well, you know, let the. Well, so. It, I don't. What? 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 Fuck away from him! Oh, away from him! Ow! Ow! Well, landing. Oh, have you? Ah! Damn, got fucked up. Godwin, where the hell are you? What the hell, dude? Is that him? Yo! Alright, nice. Holy shit! Where even am I? I'd love to. And Henry too, I'm sure. Right, Henry? Stop that nonsense, Godwin. Are you out of your mind? What will people say? They can say what they like. What do I care? What do they do to me? Watch the step, my dear. Careful, you don't hurt yourself. Here we are. Look at this beauty. <laughs> Can <laughs> ring the bell? This? Can we? Who says? Get ringing, wench. <laughs> <laughs> this is wonderful. Ah, <laughs> oh, bloody elf. <laughs> And now, my dears, comes the climax of the evening. <laughs> God, my you old goat. Come here. Shaq, close your eyes. The priest has mounted up. What do you say, Henry? Shall we take a little ride of our own? <laughs> Damn, I'm still fucking drunk as shit. Oh my god. Earn the well, priest's trust. I have to say that was a fine evening. Still gotta figure out what happened at the village. Godwin, you beast! Get up! Do you hear me? 
Wake up, you drunkards! Oh, fucking hell. Oh, oh, where the... Oh, what the... Oh, who the hell are you? Oh, Henry. <laughs> My great friend, Henry. Didn't we have a wonderful time? Well, you oh. certainly did, you old lecher. Now you better pull yourself together quick. You haven't much time. There's some water and something to eat on the table there, but if I were you, I would move my hairy arse before my flock eats me alive. Oh, Christopher, in my head. Oh, my guts. Oh, my poor suffering stomach. Oh, what was that woman on about? Before my flock eats me alive, I've forgotten something. Oh, no. What have I forgotten? Where the fuck am I? What the fuck was it? Oh. Mass! Oh shit, I have to say mass. I gotta say mass. You have to help me. Ow! You're the priest. I can't do it in this state. Maybe the liturgy. But I have to give a sermon as well. Oh, this is a disaster. They're gonna excommunicate me. I'd like to help you, but you can. You can do the sermon for me. What? So, first I investigate a murder no one wants investigated. Then I drunkenly keep the whole town up all night. And now you want me to preach at them from the pulpit? Oh. Do you want them to burn us at the stake? No. No, I've got it. Suppose it's Sir Ratzig's protege. You just came from studying in Prague. And you want to share the words of Master Jan Hus, who you recently heard preaching there. Henry, look, from what I remember, we might have overdone it a bit last night. And if the bailiff or someone else complains about me, the bishop's going to have my guts for garters. So I'd appreciate it. Stop gaping at me like a stuffed squirrel and start helping. You're mad. You're start raving mad. I'm not. It's a perfect plan. It's flawless. <coughs> oh. How about this? If you help me with this. I'll tell you who Lubosh's cronies are. What? But after that whole thing about confession. Yo. So all at once the confessional seal isn't so sacred? Don't mock me. I won't give you a second chance. God damn it. <sighs> well, all right. But I can't make any promises about what will happen. No, neither can I. What do you want me to do, exactly? I'll go and start the liturgy. Then I'll introduce you. You give the sermon I told you yesterday in the tavern, and that's that. No need to drag it out. If it turns out well, I'll tell you what I know about Lubos. Christ almighty. Fine, then. We have a deal. Wonderful. Let's get to it, then. Oh, shit. Are you kidding me? Still slightly drunk? Oh, it's bright as shit. Oh, yeah, hold up. Do I have, like, bread or anything to eat? Three bad... Uh, every, everything... Oh, I have some of these. We got some mushrooms. <coughs> My nourishment is not full. sleep a wink last night with all that clamor. In nomine Patris, et Fili, et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. Amen. 
Yeah, by clothes, dude. Accepit panem in sanctas at venerabiles a manus suas. <clears throat> Hoc facite in meam commemorationem. Yes. Brothers and sisters, you may have had the honor of meeting Henry from Scalitz, who is here at the behest of Sir Hanush to investigate that heinous crime at Neuhof. You might not know that Henry recently visited Prague, where, by the grace of God, was able to hear Master Jan Hus from the esteemed Charles University preaching. I've managed to persuade Henry to stand here today in my stead and tell us what he heard. Because, as you all probably know, Jan Hus is a very popular preacher in Prague. So, Henry, you may begin. Oh, yeah. Now I'm curious. Curious which one of them will puke first. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. Ah. Uh. <coughs> Brothers and sisters in Christ, I would um, uh, uh, I would like to talk to you about our Holy Mother Church and what iniquities it's declining into. That whelp wants to preach about the church. Shit. Creation has given to every man the power by which he might rule the whole world. But that power does not give him the right to rule. That right belongs to God alone. <clears throat> okay, okay, chill. It is the corruption of God's pastors here on earth that has brought misfortune on our heads. Uh, plague, humans, hunger, and, and, and chaos. And it is all due to... Um, <clears throat> what? The corrupt servants of God, who do not practice what they preach. They think sins can be washed away by money. And they sell indulgences, and, and that... That's bad. Because sins cannot be redeemed with silver. Prague didn't do much for his confidence. Oh my god. It is the custom of the gluttonous prelates and monks to preach against sin. But what do they know of us ordinary folk? Let us remember the marriage at Cana, where our Lord Jesus Christ himself feasted with the other guests and drank his fill. And when the wine was gone, he performed a miracle and created more. He, whose companions were poor travellers, simple folk, prostitutes and troublemakers, performed a miracle so the feast could continue. Now that's the kind of sermon I like to hear. No, brothers and sisters. Oh, Jesus shit. did not condemn alcohol. Drink to lighten the cross you bear in this veil of tears, but not with such abandon that you cannot keep holy the Sabbath. For there should be moderation in all things, and it is not drinking itself that is sinful, but intemperance and beastly indulgence. He's right! Yay! Continue harshly. Enough about sin, which the prelates are so fond of preaching about, and whose absolution they promise if you only pay enough coin to Mother Church. What if the devil himself were to pay? Will the bishops tell us he too would ascend to heaven? And what about those bishops? They sin without remorse, and with the money grasped from the poor for indulgences, they keep fine horses and hordes of servants to pamper them. They play dice and garb their mistresses in expensive furs, while Christ, the Lamb of God, walked barefoot and had nowhere to lay his head. Look to your consciences, you robbers of the poor, for you are seen by God and his people too. Down with the prelates. Away with them. We're fortunate to have our good father Godwin. At least he's a fair and simple man. Yeah. Uh. I say to you in the words of Jan Hus, he who knows much, let him speak much. He who knows little, 
Let him speak little. Let each speak as much as he knows. And he who knows nothing, let him at least teach his neighbour one virtuous deed by setting him good example and refraining from playing dice and from fornication. And that applies both to priests and to you, brothers and sisters. That's his conclusion? That is all I heard in Prague. What? Amen. Yo, that was a good finish. Have you no shame, you pair of buffoons? I'll be writing to the bishop of this. For shame. Utterly blasphemous. Can you believe such behavior? For men of the cloth to get drunk at So, is our deal still on? Are you pulling my fucking pizzle? I couldn't have done worse myself if I'd puked on the altar. Well, I'm no preacher. Yeah, I noticed. And I wasn't the only one. I thought that was going you can't well. Be serious. After all that. All what? All you making a complete hash of my sermon? You were supposed to help, not get me into even more trouble. Now I'll have the bishop on my back and all the villagers. Just leave. I need to pull myself together. And what am I supposed to do? Find someone else to help you. Yo. I thought we were friends, man. Dude. Your head out of the door now and again, you old idler. First it's pissing down, then roasting hot. Good luck to then you. Then the wind would blow you off. Yo. Do it again. Um, is this my manual save? I could just like skip the dialogue. Hmm. Yeah, I can just uh, skip the dialogue. Do, do putting clothes on does that actually matter? I mean, I, I I don't look that great, but it's fine. It's all dirty. I'm not sure, where do you even go to wash your face? Can I just like go up to this and wash? Oh. Go buy nice clothes? Dude, the bell is ringing, buddy. We gotta go. Brothers and sisters, boy has a cheek. Okay. Uh. Just as we hear that. Okay. It is the the accursed when dogs they show no. You want to bat for shame? Yes. And what if someone who can tell nothing? Yes. Enough of what is the devil? And what about they play dog? Look to your down with the. We're fortunate. Okay, from here we we'll, we can chill. God sees what is happening on earth, and he is filled with righteous wrath that those who should seek the salvation of souls instead seek mammon and the idle comfort of lucrative posts. Blessed are the shepherds who share the poverty of their flock, who are as one with you and bear with you the burden of this earthly pilgrimage, who do not condemn your venial sins. Oi! All honour to Godwin! Let him drink like one of us! That is all I heard in Prague. Amen. Damn, owned. Did they buy it? They're chattering. I think they did. The lad spoke well, considering what a soak he is. Nice. Like the young man shouldn't drink so much, but the Lord's given him a I'm silver glad he tongue. Came here. I don't suppose I'll ever get to Prague. He told it nicely. And well, well, my boy, you have talent, and I can't deny it. And you pulled a thorn from my side. I almost didn't make it. Yeah, I noticed. Well, I wasn't the only one. Oh, what's to be done? I'll make it up somehow. So, about our bargain. 
Although it's a sin. Ja, das ist And fornication. God does forgive a penitent. So, what did Limpy Lubosch tell you? Was he at Neuhof that day? Who was with him? And, and, and where are they now? Now slow down. I'm sorry, but he didn't tell me that much. Oh my God. Don't let me down after all I've been through. For you? Well, now Lubos came to me shortly after it happened. And his conscience was gnawing at him. And I must say, uh, in the end, he turned out to be a better man than he looked. He said they'd been hired through some crony of theirs. And at first they were just to steal some horses. But then it all turned sour and people started getting killed. And neither he nor his cronies wanted anything to do with that. So they fell out from the gang and fled. Fell out? Yeah, there was a body found in the woods by Neuhoff. That would explain something. Uh, Lubos kept jabbering that he wasn't a murderer, that he didn't want to do it. So I know that Lubos killed the murderer and he's dead too. The trouble is, I need to find the ones who are still alive. I need names and places. Did he mention any of the others? Uh, only nicknames. Uh, he talked about some fella called Riki from Ledechko, Pius, Timmy. Pius. <laughs> that lot are about as pious as I am ordained. Nonsense. You would make an excellent priest. And anyhow, with your skills, you ought to be able to sniff out this Riki from Ledechko, right? <laughs> well, we'll have to now. There's not much else to go on. Let's hope he's not hanging from the wall, too. <sighs> Indeed. And I'd hate to be excommunicated for nothing. Anyhow, good luck. You watch out for yourself. These people clearly mean business. And I'd like to raise a tankard with you again sometime. Yeah, I'll try. Although I'm not sure I'd survive another night of your debauchery. And if anyone should ask, you heard nothing from me. I'll deny everything. <laughs> I don't doubt it. So, yeah, this is a wild goose chase. It really is. God damn. Hey, yo, man, I need God be with you. I need some food. Farewell. Give me like ten, nine bread. Wait, did I not just buy the fucking bread? What just happened? This bread roll is bad. Did I not buy the fucking bread, dude? Good luck to you. I thought I literally just bought it. Nine. Buying. Close the deal. Oh, whoops. Oh, shit, my nourishment, dude. What if I just keep eating this? Cheap wine. All right, my nourishment's all the way up, and I'm on the verge of death. It's all good though. Track down Riki. Fuck me, yo, Riki. Okay, we can get there. Let me save. Um. Oh, did I eat the moldy bread? Oh, and I need to go. All the way down here, so let me... We're gonna have to fast travel. Oh, this is gonna take a while. <gasps> travel on horse. Wait, if I'm on my horse, do I travel fast? Uh, is that actually a thing? If you mount and fast travel, is it faster? Oh, I had no idea. Hey, put that shit down! Wounding arrow, hunting arrow, better hunting arrow. Relax. Relax. 
Oh fuck. Oh, the bows? Super effective. Holy shit. Don't do it. Don't do it. Please spare me. I yield. Let him go disarmed. Have him pay to be released. You're not getting off scot free. Pay up. Very well. Yeah, motherfucker. Take all of this, the goblet, the ring, some arrows. The black hood was kind of cool. Jesus Christ. Boromir. What? I don't follow. You didn't realize how much damage you took. Oh shit, that black hood looks nice, man. Sheesh. New dripper. He's fucking dripping. He's fucking dripping. He's fucking driving. It's like a storm. He's dripping. Oh, the bathhouse is right there. The bathhouse. How far is this actually? It's right here. Oh, this is the one from that I first saw in the beginning of the game. All right, chat, close your eyes. We're only doing this for the buff. All right. I just, we need the buff. Greetings. Okay, we need the I'm services, so what and we need to pay for a wench. I'd like, um... That can be arranged? Pay in advance. Fine. I'm sure you'll be extremely satisfied. <sighs> oh. 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 Loading. Four hours. Game saved. When the tournament failed. Hey, yeah, do I... Oh, do I still have to, like, clean and shit? Unless that was the whole, uh, the works. I am sh Okay, come on. Is that my horse right there? All right, let's get the hell out of here. I was watching on the TV sound system. Get fucked. All right, let's move. I don't know why I marked that, but let's move. Yeah. Torch out, we always travel at night. This game online. Yes. Yeah. Yes, it is. Everybody here is a real player. Oh, I actually need to go take the bridge route. Yeah. Yeah. By the way. Yeah. By the way.
Tell me I'm right and this is the bridge. Oh my god. I'll call the horse on the other side. I better not go in any further. I might drown. Are you kidding me? Where is this bridge? Further down the road. We gotta keep going. It's down this way. Dude, he weighs so much. He has a bunch of armor on. He's just gonna sink. Alright, it's this bridge. You can talk to Teresa and get the dog. Oh yeah, someone did mention that. I feel like you guys are wrong and it's a whole side quest. It is? Yeah, I'm only doing the main fucking story chat, alright? I ain't looking to do every single tidbit in this game. I don't have that much patience. We're going on a huge goose fucking chase. I gotta see how this game gets better. Yeah. left here okay that's a bush is it down to the right We're traveling the whole country. How do you third person from the horse? Yeah. Oh, you need a mod? Grindstone. It'd be cool to actually yeah. figure out how you grind stone. I think I can just like walk up to this and use it. Okay, how the fuck does this work? Position, pressure, pedal. Ah. So clearly where it's fucked, you're trying to go for it. I don't know if it's actually fixing it or not. I think it is.
Dude, I don't I don't see how it works. Okay. All right, sparks good, smoke bad. I, I swear to God, it like flips by itself. Like, why does it just fucking jolt? Like, why does it do that? It just jolts. I'm not even doing anything. Pressure. Does this visually actually change? When you do it correctly? Yeah, I don't know why it keeps jolting. The more pressure shit, I don't even see a change on him moving the blade. Okay, I got a decent amount of it out. I don't know if you can fix that chip in the blade. I know it's ruined. Chat, at this point, this is just like a practice sword. Relax. This is like a fucking bastard shit sword of the eagle. First part is the pressure adjustment. And visually, it doesn't really show you well 
how the pressure is actually adjusting. This is just all sorts of... Okay, apparently that worked. I can't tell if I'm getting this chip out or not. Repair the small spot. the bullshits out I just I don't know if I can I think it's just how it is now this might just be the best if the stone turns red it was too much I don't think you can fix that. I don't think you can. I think uh, the little like janky parts you fix, but the actual cracks you can't. There's literally no keybind to flip it. Check the quality of the sword now. It's at 98, so I mean. It. You sharpen every blade before selling it to get a lot of money. Alright, we might need to just like sit on a bench and pass time. We made it here. We are here. We are here. Rotate. We are at rotate. The lodgings? Yeah, I'm just gonna st literally stay right here till 9 a.m. I ain't fucking moving. I'm gonna just stand right here till 9 a.m. All right. You gotta track down Riki. This guy fucking knows, you suspicious fuck. Oh, it's Good the bailiff. Riki! I'm looking for a fellow called Riki. Do you know him? Riki. You mean Hinek, the courier's son? Maybe. Do you know where I might find him? Well, he's not usually around here. Try asking at his home. But I hope you've got a thick skin. The old courier ain't exactly charming. Oh, shoot. Do you know uh, him? Can you tell me anything about him? 
Wait, why do they call Hinek Riki anyway? He's a tanner, isn't he? If you're ever downwind of him, you'll understand. Tanning isn't a trade for the weak of stomach. True enough. But not every courier gets cursed with a name like that. Well, Hinek's nature's no sweeter than his smell. Oh. What can you tell me about the old courier? He's as cantankerous as a hog in a thorn bush. He won't talk to anyone. Okay. So you know this Hinek. Can you tell me something about him? Well, not much, I confess. Most of the village folk avoid him like the plague. Why is that? Well, no one with a nose likes spending too much time around tanners. And that Riki keeps bad company. I've never heard a good word said about him. Okay. Why has he got such a bad name? Hmm. Well, like his old man, he doesn't talk much to anyone. And then he's always skulking off somewhere. I heard he got a taste of the pillory and retire for thieving. And in Neuhof, he got boozed up in the alehouse with his cronies. And they beat up some merchants. Whoa. So a bit more than high spirits. Just so. This We're all guy. honest folk here, and we've no use for the likes of him. Nice. Farewell. Farewell. Wait, so go track down, talk to Riki's father. <laughs> fucking asshole's father. Of course, he's across the fucking whole town. Pebbles! Let's go! Yeah. Yeah. All right, Ricky's father, huh? Ricky. Oh, I think this is their house here. That's perfect, boy. Stay there, boy. Is this Ricky's father? Oh, this is the tanner. God be with you. I'm looking for your son. Any idea where he might be? I don't know nothing. Don't he you knows something. Know where he usually goes. It's important. Hinek shows up at home once in a blue moon, so I don't know nothing about where he gets to. Even if I did, why would I tell every Tom, Dick, and Harry? Oh, okay, don't make me angry. Listen, your son's in serious trouble. I'm trying to help him, and my patience is wearing extremely thin. If you start answering my questions, this is going to go a lot better for everyone. Yeah. Are you threatening me? And I'm supposed to believe you want to help Hinek? Believe what you like. I'm concerned about Hinek, but I really don't much care what happens to you. Is that clear? Fuck it. Oh. I'm not going to take a beating on account of that good for nothing. So? There's not much I can do for you anyway. Hinek came here, but he left right away. Well, where did he go? You better give me something. You really don't want to waste my time. Yeah. Hinek makes some money on the side from poaching. He boasted to me a few times about what a great hideout he found in the woods. But he never told me where it is. Well, it's not much to go on. But it's better than nothing. All these Thank motherfuckers you. are always in the woods. Don't you have any clue at all where his hideout could be? I really don't know nothing about that. I could tell when he'd come from there is all. How's that? Because every time he brought some hides for tanning and money. He had money because he sold the stuff right away? I suppose. He never kept any of his loot here. Do you know who he sold it to? No. But the innkeeper came here now and again and gave him coin. Of course, it could have been for me. All right. I'll ask at the inn then. The inn! Go. And if he's really in as much shit as you say. All right, let's go to the inn. Just to pinpoint where he is, you know, I could just go right into the forest to try to find him, but I don't think it's worth it. Da -da -da. You can sort inventory by price. I'm aware. Who am I talking to? Oh, this is the innkeeper. Jesus Christ be praised. I want to ask about the courier's son, Hinek. And ask someone else. They have nothing to do with Riki. He only drive my customers away. <laughs> really? I heard a different story. I heard the two of you do business together. Who are you anyway? A friend Who of Who are you? He's gone missing yeah. and I need to find him. I don't know where he is. 
But if you find the bastard, tell him he still owes me some goods. <laughs> uh, buying from po a po uh, poachers is a crime. I don't give a damn what deals you've been doing together. I won't tell anyone. I just need to know where Riki is. It's urgent. What have our deals got to do with where he disappeared to? <laughs> More than you think. It's likely Riki is hiding out at his poaching lair. And believe me, it wasn't hard to find out who was buying game from him, and it's even easier to go to the castle and tell them. Poaching's a crime, after all. All right. Yes! Well, right. give me your word of honor. You won't tell anyone about our deal. You have my word. Fine. So, what do you want to know? Hideout. I hear Hinek has a hideout in the woods he uses for hunting game. Do you know where it is? Not exactly. That is... I don't know where it is at all. Come oh, on. But I happen to know it's a dark place. A cave or an old mine shaft. How do you know that? Whenever Riki was going poaching, he always came to me first for candles and that point. He brought the game skinned and gutted, so he had to have a light for that. How much game did he bring you? Uh, mm. And do you know of any mine shafts nearby? There's a few of them around. There's one on the opposite bank, a short way off the path leading from the forge to the west. Then there's a mine gallery to the east of the village, uh, up in the woods above the cliffs. And I heard there's one shaft on the headland close to the water. Thank you. All right, I think You're we're welcome. good here. Watch you don't break your neck, though. It's rough ground, and you could easily fall down a shaft. All right. Find the disused mine shaft on the left bank. Track down Riki. Find the disused. Find the shaft on the promontory. Oh wait, he said find the cave by the hills. Oh my god. Maybe we talk to more people. There's a lot, unless you're supposed to go to all three areas. Like you might be able to pinpoint, but we got to do all three. Let's go. Um, maybe. Let's go south first. It's gonna be. Yeah. It is. D. Oh, these over there. Yeah. Oh, this is nice. Yeah, this game has a great OST. I haven't gone to Sir Bernard yet, no. Or reported back to him. Someone said he gives you a counterattack that he teaches you. So I gotta meet him. I know I have a bunch of perks, I'm just letting him kind of add up. Point of this shit. Found it. So that was a useless lead. All right. Baited and jabated. Play without the map and go with the flow. Yeah, I'm not doing that. We're gonna be here all day, dude. I mean, we're gonna be here all day anyways, but... Yeah! Still. Oh! Good job, horsey. Yeah! I 
I know, dude wants me to play this for like 200 hours. Alright, let's see what we have yeah. here. We gotta climb this hill. No, it is a good game, yeah, but... Gets good after 2,000 hours. Relax, boy. Relax. Relax. Sniff this tree. Relax. What the fuck are you looking for here? Oh, shit. I won't put up with the locks of you. Buddy, I will fucking stab you, bro. Come really? here, Lily Liver. <laughs> 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 I don't want to do this, you piece of shit. This is your fault. <laughs> is that the best you can do? Nope. Oh shit, yes. Ow. Fuck. He sucked. He evaded. He didn't evade that. Actually, wait. You're lucky I'm in a good mood. Go on, vanish. If I see you again, I'll kill you. Yes. Go wait, no, 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 don't leave. I was. God damn it. <gasps> Holy shit, he's still going. I wanted to talk. Oh, well. And <sighs> shit happens. This is another kind of wrong area. Trash. What the hell were they doing in here? It's kind of random. Why were they in there? So it is up north. The dad was right. Alright, should have listened to the dad, dude. The dad was... He was the one who said up north. Yeah. Alright, let's go. <laughs> Always go north. Yeah, north seems to always be the answer. I seem to always get stuck. Yeah, I'm stuck in the worst spot right now. Wow, that was the... I don't know how yeah. I ended up in that random ass place. The FOV isn't messed up. This is fine. Oh, I found a trail. Rate Woods. He has to be up here. He must. Yeah, just in case it's been a second. Uh oh. Oh shit. Oh no. Jesus Christ, what am I to do? 
Not that I can expect any useful advice from you. At least, you have no more cares. Need someone to talk to? Fuck! Don't, don't kill me! I, I can explain! I won't tell anyone. I swear, I've no one to tell anyway. Just please don't kill me. I'm not planning to kill you. You're, you're not one of Runt's men? No. Huh. Who's Runt? Then who are you? Then who are you? I come here in the name of Sir Radzik Kabila and Sir Hanish of Lipo. I'm investigating the raid on the Neuhof stud farm. I've got no idea what you're on about. I'll save your breath. If you want any chance to escape the gallows, you'd better come clean, all right? Jesus Christ. This will never be over. So? Fine, then. That Neuhof raid of yours didn't turn out quite as planned, did it? Depends on whose plan you're talking about. We were up to it to grab some loot and bugger off. Only Runt's cutthroats was there to shed blood. What do you mean, Runt's cutthroats? There were two gangs there. Mine and Runt's. We was only there to steal, but they wanted to slaughter everyone. But when you realised what they had in mind, you didn't have to go along with it, did you? But we didn't know nothing, even though we were going to Neuhof. They told us to keep watch on the courtyard while they were cutting the horses' throats. Jesus, that fucking vexed me. Their horses was the most valuable thing there. When I spoke up, though, Runt gave me such a bollocking I knew I'd better keep my mouth shut. And when they said we was going to kill anything that moved, then we knew there was no going back. Runt's gang. Did you know any of Runt's people? Now we gotta find Not Runt's all. gang. They didn't talk to us at all. None of their faces was familiar either. The only thing I know is they called that huge chief of theirs Runt. And Pius warned us to watch out for him. Where are the Runt and the rest? I don't rest? suppose you know where they got to after the raid. On the way to Neuf, Timmy told me he was at their camp with Pius. I reckon that's where they've gone now. Pius, where's the camp? Did Timmy tell you where the camp is? Somewhere in the woods. He didn't say nothing more. Thing is, Timmy's got quite an imagination. But Pius roared at him to shut it, so I reckon there must be something in it. Okay, now we gotta go to Pius. Mmm. Eh. We're good. That gang of yours, what can you tell me about them? Don't know what you want to know. There was four of us. Me, Timmy, Limpy Lubosh, and Pius Pava. Sometimes we'd rob a place or hold up pilgrims. Never nothing fancy. I'm sure you did mischief enough. Who led you? Pius. He was the oldest and he'd mostly find the jobs for us. Plan them and the like. He got us into that fucking mess in Neuhof too. What about the others? Timmy's strong as an ox with a brain to match. You got more sense out of a fence post. And Limpy, I've been with him the longest. He's my one and only friend, I suppose. Oh God, he doesn't know. Does he know he's dead? Who got your two gangs together? You must have made contact somehow, right? Pius, he comes to us and says he's got this prime job. We're gonna rob a farm, he says. That was a big deal, cause mostly we just did small stuff. A hold up on the road now and then, nothing fancy. When they told us how much we could make on it, well, we just couldn't refuse. So Pius knew them? I suppose, but I don't know where from. We even got paid up front. I should have known from the start it was too good to be true. What happened after the raid? We were waiting for that fool, Timmy. Same place as we met them before, so he'd know where we were, right? Stupid fucking idea. But Pius didn't want to leave him behind. Only when Timmy finally turned up, two of Runt's men were dragging him. There was some difference of opinion? You could say that, yeah. They started on us right away that we were traitors. They knew we'd let somebody get away, and now we were going to pay for it. They started trying to surround us, and we knew what was coming. Limpy took his bodkin and let that fucker have it in the belly. Runt. One of the others. Timmy broke free from them and we all took to our heels. Luckily they were so buggered from the raid they didn't follow us for long. They just shouted that they'd find us. Ah. Damn, he I gotta ask him everything? 
Where did the rest of your gang end up? You saw Limpy, right? Yes, but he's no Limpy. Use to me Tell me where I can find Pius or Timmy. I don't know nothing about Pius. He vanished in the woods, and I haven't seen him since. Timmy, I reckon, went back to the mill where he works. Which mill? The windmill a bit north of Neuhof. Oh, shit. That's all I need to know. So now what do I do with you? Well... Hey, over here! It's a bell. Shh. Oh, shit. Found the tape. Shut up. Oh, shit. Rance people. We've got to get out of here. But they're too close. We'll never outrun them. Yo, they came here. Fuck. At least they don't know I'm here. The two of us can take them by surprise. No fucking way. I'm gone. Look here. If you run, they'll catch up with you and kill you. And me too. Together, we stand a better chance. Don't tell me I gotta protect Jesus him. Jesus Christ. All right. I suppose you're right. I gotta change my helmet, dude. That thing was sticking out. Everybody could see it. I'm changing it. We see you, idiot. We fucking see you, Thomas. You're right there, man. We fucking see you. We, oui. who's there? Well, well, come crawling out from under some. Oh, shit! Cool the. Is that oh. 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 Hey, everybody, relax! Oh. oh my god, where am I? You're dead! Oh. Shit! Oh. Dude, this guy's fucking crazy. Did they kill him? They fucking killed him, didn't they? Come on, then, oh, son. You've got to be kidding. Oh, ow, you fucking double teaming shit. <laughs> Is that the best you can do? Oh dear, I'm dead. Yeah, I think the combat in this game, I think I still just need more moves and shit, you know? You have to launch through the launcher to get mods. Um, I don't know if you have to. Turns up willing. <laughs> Is that the best you could do? Oh, fuck. Damn, 
Damn, this guy just fucking counters over and over. Well landed. Fuck. I forgot the kick button. Helmet, I agree. I can't take it off. Nice. Hey! Where does friends go? I think it said inquire after Timmy at, at the windmill. Yeah, I guess he just left. Can I use this guy's weapon? I could try sh sword and shielding. After Timmy. Oh, yeah, I can just go northwest on my horse. Yeah, actually, uh. Yeah. Hmm. Can you, uh, dual swords? I just moved away and ended up uh, making that a 1v1 instead of a 2v1 by moving slightly. It's kind of random. Almost yeah. there. Yeah, next time I see Bernard, I'll try to learn counterattack. But, uh, I already spoke to- I'm pretty sure counterattack requires level 5 strength. Or level 5 defense. Okay, so we're looking for Timmy. You just have to talk to him at the arena? Oh. <laughs> Alright, real quick, just in case. Something 
tells me this guy's dead. Discovered the windmill. Yeah, it's very quiet here. I'm in the right area, right? I am. up here? Not the rarest sword in the game stashed in this place? Uh, Timmy? Jesus Christ be praised. The hell? Do you know Timmy? He's a big man and um, a complete numbskull. Aye, he works here, or he used to. I'm not sure. He vanished a few days ago. Far as I know, no one's seen him since. But try asking his sister Mirka. She works here too. Oh, talk well. to Mirka. Is this Mirka? I'm looking for a colossus by the name of Timmy. I heard he works here. I don't know anyone like that. I don't know. I'm here in the service of Sahanish. A ragamuffin like Ew. you? Of course you are. Come on, man. All the others know him, so how come you don't? All right, I'm oh. not here. We'll talk round the back, behind the mill. Really? Hold on, this is a tax. That stew. Ah, oh, life back in the day during these times. Wake up. Do some shit. Okay, we're here. Here I am. So, why all the secrecy? What do you want from Timmy? Can you tell me where to find him? Promise me nothing will happen to him. Why do you care so much? He's my brother. He's not very smart, you see. And he's always getting led astray by his no good friends. And now there's some right peculiar characters looking for him. Who are they? I don't know. But they looked like cutthroats, and they said some strange things, but I didn't tell them anything. That's good. But sooner or later they'll find him anyway. Tell me where he is, and I'll take care of him. He's hiding at the Colburn farm, over by Merroyed. <laughs> oh, shit. The feeling you're looking for someone here. I'm looking for someone too. Maybe we could help each other. I doubt it. I don't think so. No? Why not? I don't like your face. I mind my own business. I don't stick my nose into other people's affairs, and I expect the same from them. That's a shame. A crying shame. I take good care of people who help me. Now, if someone were to tell me where to find Timmy, I might offer that man a job. We could use a smart fellow like that at the camp. Guys, I can't. I can't, guys. Sir Bernard's gonna be like, what the hell have you been doing for the past week? The lead. 
Yeah, is, this is a lie. I hear he's hiding in Ratai. Oh, yeah? Where in Ratai? I, I don't know. You'll have to find him yourself. Sounds like a pile Fuck. of bullshit to me. Stop wasting my time and spit it out. Uh, I don't know where he is. I've no idea where he is. I reckon I'll have to try my luck elsewhere. Don't try to tell me she told you nothing. You send me to Ratte, and then you say you know nothing, spit it out right now. Oh, God. All right, I'll tell you where he is. Really? Why would you do that? We're all Christians here, aren't we? Why not help thy neighbour? Especially if he pays two score groschen. Ha! <laughs> you wouldn't be my cousin by any chance. I'll give you two dozen, no more. Half now, and half when we find him. Deal. Wait. Nah, we have to attack. You don't know when to give up, do you? The one who has the upper hand does as he pleases. Boy. True. Only you don't have the upper hand. You're what in the wrong here? place. Hey, 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 yo. Great. I'll snarl at you. <laughs> oh my god. This combat is fucking ridiculous, dude. Dude, like, what even, what even is that? I like this game, but it's so clunkily weird at times. Holy shit. God damn it. One v four? I know, man. It's just fucking awkward, chat. Stop trying to defend the fucking game, bro. It, you can't deny it's awkward. You're not a hero? Sure. But the guy was fucking running into me. Yeah, yeah, hold up. Let me heal. Oh, shit. Here I am. What? Can you tell me? What do you? And who I That's. I've got the feeling I'm looking for. Oh, no. You have an. The, the answer, answer to, to my prayer. prayer. You'll get what I want. Just when I want my rage, vent my rage. <laughs> What's the matter? Come on! Ah! 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 Okay. That's forbidden here. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I know, yeah. You're working with them, aren't ya? Why would you say that? You're working with them. Forbidden here? There's like here population too. I don't. But I do. The answer to my prayer. Just when I wanted to vent my rage. Come on. Is that the best you could. Ha! You'll get it. Ha! Ah. Fucker! Gone weak of- ah. Alright, now you're dead. Ah. I'll slaughter you! 
Oh my god, what am I fucking tripping on, man? Ah! Good save, good save. Oh. Hello. Is it a bug? I can't talk to her anymore? Oh. Here I am. What pro Here I am. I get the feeling. Oh. Oh, you don't look true. Answer to my prayer. Just what I want you to the my brain. Brain. Is that all you got? Come! What's the matter? Fuck Come on! Yellow no. cunt. Fuck! Come in. I don't know why this guy's just deciding to run forward. No one told you to do that. <sighs> Alright, might as well funnel. Here I am. What do you Can you pro what? And now the I, I, I like your I like how you're saying I'm brute forcing this, but your stupid fucking strat the... is to go into the mill and make it so it's a pathing issue so you can 1v1 them. I don't know. Sure, dude. Because I don't What are you doing? Oh, yeah. Part of life, are you? Don't brute force it, man. Just bug the game. What's the matter? Come on! Oh. Yo, nice fucking stam regen. Call that, call that. The weak in the knees, have you? I'll slaughter you. Wait out. Oh. I've got the feet up now. You're in the wrong place at the wrong time. Okay, okay. Come weak at the knees, have you? What's the matter? Come on! Fuck! You messed me up in the beginning. Here I am. What pro- what? And who I got that? Get this up. Oh. Don't trip. Well, I, I never. never. The picture's up willing to put it on. Holy 
shit. Here I am. What? Here I am. Get the thing up. The trip. What are you doing? Who was come out of I'll slaughter you! You're dead! You're weak at the knees, have you? Here I am. What problem? Who is I thought uh, 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 Here I am. What? Pro what? Who are they? He's hot. I've got the feeling. Oh. Ha. The You're in the wrong place at the wrong time. Bring it on. Jerkin, yoink. Yo, chain mail. Ooh, that's some gear right there. Get a minute. Give you a clinch. Uh, you can deplete all his health by bumping into him at a sprint. Your sprint will not not slow down in combat, even on the weapon backswing. Okay, yes. Honestly, I, I feel like you get fucked there. Sword. Um. Double stab. Slash stab stab. Yes. I like slash stab stab. Horsemanship. Faster carries less weight. Main level. Oh sh oh my god. Increase the sight distance of fast travel. Increase the wilds of the wilds have plus one bonus on strength to the and switch. Oh nice. Bandages are terms are more effective. Towns are uh, Penalties on stats following release from jail. You grip uh, impoverished. I guess Scout 2 is not bad. Or um, Savage isn't bad either. Drinking.
I don't really care about the drinking part. A sword called Soul Slicer. Oh my god, I can use it. 64. I just need to make it a little better. I don't know if uh, the combos, it matters. It said slash, stab, stab. I don't know if uh, it matters. I think it's just any slash does it. Or does the direction of the slash matter? Is it stab, slash, slash, or direction matters? It's bottom less left slash. Oh, you have to care about that. So it's uh, bottom left stab stab. Bottom left stab stab. All right, y'all, hold up. That bow looked like it may have been uh, a better bow. Oh, wait, villagers. Oh, the U, U bow. Actually, can I use capons? 5-5, five, five, cumin bow. Is this better? Oh, yeah, this is uh, weight, price, power, 54. Same power as capons hu hunting bow. I'm gonna eat this. Okay, so we need to go find Timmy. After all that, gotta go find Timmy. Get Timmy to tell you where the other bandits are hiding. Oh, he's literally right here. One more guy? I don't know where the other third guy is. Fourth guy died. Do not remember where the fourth guy died. Yeah. Was there a fourth guy? There was a fourth guy. This guy's dead. This dude's dead. Honestly, fuck the fourth guy. Who cares? Yeah. Buddy, I jumped. Merhojed! We're here. We were eventually gonna come here anyways. Consolation Cross. Hey yo, Proton, what up, man? Thanks, dude. 
I made in this shit again. Everybody has the same recipe. Not a lot of people here. Oh, this guy's far as shit. He's like on the edge of the map. I don't know if the sword's a two-hand. I don't think... Can you even use two-handed weapons in this game? Like a great sword, I mean? Oh, shit. Yeah, I would actually use that over the shield. I just yeah. need to... Can you see what the classification is? Hunting sword? Long sword? Short sword? Wait, so I can use a long sword? Uh, I don't know if it makes sense to use a long sword with uh, a shield. Yeah, weapon long sword. Let's go no shield. Timmy! This guy looks like a Timmy. No, that's not him. He's too old. This fucking guy. Hey, Timmy. How are you today? Hey, yo, Zeon with the 25. Right. Thank you, dude. Uh, who we met? We have now. Huh? Eh? Oh, shit. What do you want? It, it wasn't me. I, I didn't... I mean... Shit. About the Neoth Massacre. I saw what you did at Neuhoff. What are you talking about? You weren't there. Uh, I mean, I wasn't there. Don't waste your breath. You were there with Limpy Lubosh and Riki. I heard all about it. What do you want from me? Your mate Hinnok told me about a whole camp full of those horse hunts. And I want to find it. I need to find it. Yeah, but... But why should I trust you, though? I'm not stupid. You might be one of them. Pretending to not be one of them. Trying to catch me out. I won't tell you nothing. <laughs> this guy's voice. I won't tell you nothing. Listen here, blockhead. I don't have all day for this. Tell me what I want to know so I don't have to hurt you. Ah, you want to fight, do you? Oh, all right. If you like. You look like you might last a minute or two. But are you serious right now? Bring it on. <laughs> God damn! Damn it! Now, now! Like, this game is good, but you're fucking high, and Pepega, if you think the combat's really, really good. It could be way better. Especially playing so many fight like sword games. Dude, he's so good at dodging. Timmy, you're done! It's over! 
You're gonna... You're gonna... You're gonna... God damn it, Timmy. Oh, you're stuck now, buddy. Yeah. Yeah, this guy is. Oh, yo, I'm leveling up so much. All of these. Oh, he's done. Alright, alright, you win. Stop it. It isn't fair. So, are you gonna tell me where I can find that camp? Yeah, I'll tell you. By the side of Jesus, what got into you? I'm a bit surprised myself. So? I don't know where their camp is. That's a load of horse shit. Hinek told me you were there and that Pius wanted you to keep your mouth shut. You must know something. Well, once I was there with them, yeah. Only, I was pretty drunk, so I'm not too sure. Try to remember. It was in the woods. In some kind of woods. You know, with uh, trees and stuff. There wow. were some wrecked houses there and all. In the woods. A, a church. There was a church there. Kind of a broken one, though. Oh, great. Thanks a lot. Now it's all clear to me. Do you remember which way you went? It was straight north from Talmberg. When you go uphill from the castle, there's a path there round some barns, I think. It leads to the woodcutter's camp. If you go further on past the woodcutters, you come across this abandoned house. Can't miss it. Looks like a house, only abandoned. Wow. Go to the left there and carry on till you come to this clearing with a big beech tree. Or was it an oak? Uh, you go left there again. There's this narrow path and you go straight along there. Sometimes it splits up. You just keep to the left until you come to a crossroads by this big flat rock. You keep straight on there. So you guys while, are writing this down, right? And it's right there. Easy as you please. Better than nothing, I suppose. But you won't tell nobody about Neuhoff, right? You promised. Oh no, bugger. I meant to make you promise, but I forgot. Ah, uh, I won't tell. No, don't worry. But in future, find some other way to make money. Like honest work? Thanks. I'll, I'll try. On account of my sister, at least. That girl at the windmill? Hi, Mirka. Did you talk to her? What did she say? She told me you're as thick as a fence post and always getting dragged into some mischief. Did she? Yeah. She's probably right. <laughs> okay. Oh, yo, right up north. Sir Radzig, dude, the full circle. Holy shit, man, we're back. Thank fucking God. This was such a long ass quest, dude. That was like a four hour wild goose chase. Go to the arena, where the fuck- If I go to Rote and go to the arena... Uh, wait, the arena opens up. Uh, where the fuck even is the arena? Activity giver? And I go to Bernard. You're telling me he'll be there? To train me? Combat arena. Okay. 
No, not that one. Not that one across the world out. Oh, this one, or is it this one? Quest Tipster Combat Arena. This is where they do arenas? This is where I trained initially. That's just to practice. What the fuck? Arena is across the bridge. That's where I was going. This combat arena. I'm just gonna wait here. I haven't slept in like three days. not tired I don't see him here I mean he was at the town where the massacre happened unless he's uh, coming downstairs now there's a bunch of people coming through yeah I think I've mastered the basics of combat. I see. And what weapon are you such a master at? I'm pretty good with a sword. You're a bit cocky, ain't you? All right, then, let's see what you can do. You're as good as I'm ready. Nice. How do you do this? Stand there, take your weapon, and fight. If you look like you know what you're doing, I'll teach you a trick or two. Oh, I did the combo. That's a good combo right there. Yield, buddy. Enough. That will do. That wasn't at all bad. All right. It seems you're ready for the next lesson. Now, ah. pay close attention. Ah. I'll teach you the most important thing. Ah. It's good to be able to attack. It's good to be able to fend off your opponent's blows. Okay. The best is when you're able to do both at once. A master stroke is when you parry your opponent's blow and strike him at the same time. Okay. Attack me, and I'll show you how it's done. Okay. Damn. Ow. See? I parry and strike in one move. There's no defense against this technique if it's executed well. The thing is to time it right. Lock right into your opponent's strike and match your movement to his. One elegant technique, and the fight is won. Try it. Okay. I'll attack slowly. You parry. Got it. Ah, right, that's it. An automatic well repost? Are you kidding me? Ugh. Talking to this guy just buffed my perfect guard. Nice. I don't even have to do anything. Ugh. It auto attacks. What? That's ridiculous, man. That's like a that's like a fucking one button easy mode. I have some uh, trophies. Let's see. Good. Good. That's how to treat the bastards. Oh shit. Uh, I think we're good, man. That was great training, dude. Shit, man. I'd like to improve. Certainly. 
I'm interested. All right. You fucking piece of shit. Now, pay close attention. This better be worth the 180. Oh wait, yeah, isn't that for... Show me a combo. You want to really hurt your opponent. It's no use just flailing at him and hoping you get lucky. You need technique, but using skilled moves is no easy matter. There's no miraculous strikes you can learn that will ensure you win every duel. You've got to work those techniques into your combat, force your opponent into a position you want him in, and then attack unexpectedly. Uh. Ow. See? I strike from overhead, then slash from the side, and back swing low down. So you expect me to strike from below, but then I turn the sword and strike you with the other side. Once more, defend. Ow. Ah. Ow. Now, you try it. Strike from above, then from the right, then slash. The strikes have to follow quickly, one after the other. As soon as one lands, you start the next. You have to keep exactly to the sequence, otherwise it won't come off. Slash from above, slash from the right, slash from below. Go! Try to catch the rhythm. As soon as one below lands, change the target. No, no, no! You have to strike me three times. Three times. No, no, no! You have to strike me three times. Three times. Try to catch the rhythm. As soon as one blow lands, change the target zone. It's good. Again. <laughs> Try to catch the rhythm. As soon as one blow lands, change the target. Try to catch the rhythm. As soon as one blow lands, change the target zone and strike again right away. Don't stop. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> That's it. Try it once more. All right. You can learn lots of similar techniques with every weapon. Train and practice. Odd. Yes. 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 Do the rotate tourney. Uh, can I even go to the tournament? Um, usually, isn't it every day you can go to the tournament? Yeah. Oh, it's every week? Shit. Alright, yo, fuck defense. I'm, I'm a fucking tank now. I know how to do this shit. Easy. It tells you on the screen a day before. Oh, okay. It's every week that happens. Ah, we are here. Yeah, I mean, actually, I could go to the mill. Or maybe that's the inn. Or it's just a barn. Horse trader? I can't afford any of them. Alright, we'll get there half asleep, I guess. Yeah. This is important here. Yeah, it might be a place to sleep here. This is the soldier's camp. Radzig! I come with word. Oh, he's right here. God be with you, lad. What can I do for you? About that encampment, sir. What is it, lad? I know where it is. I found out about the camp from another of the bandits who deserted. It's called Timmy. 
big fellow, but more brawn than brain. The camp is an abandoned village in the woods to the west of Talmberg. Good work, lad. Have you been to check it out? Do you know how many of them there are? I don't know much apart from where it is. We really need to find out more. Could you go back there and try to discover anything that could help us in the assault? The more we know, the better. Are you and if you could carry out some sabotage while you're in there, it would be invaluable. But don't take any unnecessary risks. I don't want to lose you. Okay. Certainly, sir. That is... I'll do what I can. That's what I like to hear. You'll be our eyes and ears, lad. Our success will depend on what you find out. Go, and get back here as soon as you can. Meanwhile, I'll muster my men. I'll find out what I can and be right back. Good luck to you. Where... Okay. Wait, why is this so slow? Is it because my energy is low? Oh, whoa, what the hell? I might sleep and then go from there. Yeah. I'm on a, like an odd schedule right now, though. Get there in the morning, I guess. <laughs> Do I have any food? Fruit? <laughs> Alright, I'm healthy. I have full energy. My nourishment is full. All is good. Wait, once you start the quest, you don't want to continue. Shit, I gotta go right at 6.30 to die. Uh, maybe even a little earlier. Maybe this is a good sp spot to chill. To continue, because if I start this now, I kind of gotta like... I don't know if this is like a whole thing. Like the whole shit just... This is kind of, this is like the climax of the quest. Yeah, it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause we're, we're actually, all, it all comes down to this. Which means we have one attempt to sweep a game. Maybe two. Um, and then we're gonna, I'm gonna continue playing that tomorrow for sure.